Hi friends. Um, I have a mail day, but it's something kind of different from what you've seen. It's sewing related. So it's the, uh, let's just sew whatever. Um, I was super excited about this from the moment I saw it. So let's start, let's jump in. Here is, it's a project box basically, and it comes, this is the pattern. So it's to make this like crossbody bag, which means a bit, well, I guess it's like any standard crossbody, which admittedly I like, I have more of than I use, but I don't care, I like it. Um, and it comes with all the supplies and some snips and I love the snips that I have so I'm very excited to have another pair because I'm like continually moving them from one project area to another <laughs> this ruler and Rulers are just so useful to have more of. And this one is glittery. Which is cute. Uh, wouldn't be, I think, I think if you are a quilter, I don't know that this is a great one if you're like fussy cutting. Because the glitter pattern gets over it, but it's, Tough to say. And then what it comes the zipper for it is hot pink. Beautiful. It's got this little notepad that I suspect is not fountain pen friendly. <laughs> That's okay. It has this little cork label. Cut and sewn by hand. A little um, fabric label that says I did it some little glitter clips a marking pin this is a the kind of marking pin that you use on leather actually and the thing that like stole my heart immediately was this to me, it's very stained glass looking, uh, and it reminds me of Sleeping Beauty, the Disney film. I don't know if there's a good reason for that, but it's waterproof canvas. Mm, smells wonderfully plasticky. I love it. Mm, like, like new school supplies or something. And... Get off my back, okay? <laughs> and then a water resistant canvas, and this color is like sharks teal. So A plus 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 and hardware that is black nickel. Some people refer to it as like gun metal. So I'm excited. I don't know when I'll sew this. Maybe this weekend, because why not? I'm in, I'm, I'm in between sewing projects. I mean, that's not true. I have plenty that I should be doing. The stack of things to finish is big. And what better way to finish things than to buy start to, than to uh, start something new, right? That's how it gets finished? I think that's right. So, <laughs> I'm not sure yet if I'll like try and make a video of me making this bag. Um, there's plenty of tutorial videos out there. I will not make that kind of thing. But I might share the experience because I'm not great at making bags. I'm pretty good at making clothes. I'm pretty good at making quilts. Bags. I mean, I'm fine at it. But realistically, I don't have the right kind of sewing machine. So what I have should work. 
it'll be sufficient, but it's not going to like exceed expectations. Um, all in all, I'm really happy with this. The value for money for this struck me as exceptionally good. Um, like the cost of rulers like this is disgusting. So, like that in itself. Um, and also like, who did, look at these, hold on, let's look at these clips better. They're kind of a green color more than blue. But they're pretty. They're sparkles. Sparkles and rainbow anodized. I like the sound they make. And then here's this. That has a nice pleasing click to it too. Um, I've watched Lauren explain like approximately a million times how to put these together. It's pretty self-explanatory, but I think um, things that you think are self-explanatory aren't to somebody because you're assuming that somebody's had the same experiences as you if you think they should just know. Uh, at any rate, look, I'm going to shut up now. Thanks for hanging out while I look at my new stuff. Should we look at this in the sunlight and see if it looks magical? And it does. Yep. Have a wonderful day. Bye.